Hello everyone and welcome to Travel Beans. That's right, I have finally stopped <laughs> my hair overtaking my face and got it all cut. Today we will be taking you guys with us on our little adventure around the Forest of Dean. We are here in gloomy Gloucestershire in the Forest of Dean and more specifically Puzzlewood. Puzzlewood is an enchanted ancient forest that you may actually recognize from certain movies such as Star Wars or Harry Potter which if you haven't seen those movies what's wrong with you? Alex and I are super excited because we are at the entrance now and the entrance alone looks pretty magical. It doesn't take long once you're in to stumble across these really striking rock formations. These are very iconic to the area. Now you might actually recognize here if you've seen Star Star Wars because there is some famous scenes in Star Wars in The Force Awakens which was shot here. Also Harry Potter was shot here and just to top it off J.R.R. Tolkien used to be a regular visitor of these specific woods and they are said to be a huge inspiration to all of the different woods that he had in Middle Earth. Entrance for one adult to Puzzlewood is just seven of your finest English pounds and it is worth every penny in my opinion. Not only for the unquestionably breathtaking nature that is surrounding you as soon as you walk in, but also for the history that you get to learn when you come here. This forest is famous for its iron and iron extraction dates back to Roman times. That's right, the Romans were here then in Puzzlewood making weapons, taking all the iron. In the 1800s they actually found here 3,000 Roman coins in jars just stuffed into the rocks and for the children among us they actually have a little game so you can go and find them around the forest. This is so cool. I think coming to places like this, it literally awakens the child inside me. I am like the most excitable person. I feel like I'm, I'm on a movie set exploring places just like in Lord of the Rings. In my mind, this is actually one of, I mean, I know I've said this a lot, but this is one of the coolest looking places I've seen in a really long time. It's completely different from everywhere else that we've seen in England on this road trip. The formations of the rocks are just astonishing. So my understanding is that there was a cave system underneath and due to erosion in the cave system and then the actual uplift of the ground it has produced these walkways through there and I actually think you can go walking through them. I know, I think if we go down, like down one of these footpaths we can go like in between the rocks. I'm not even slightly surprised that so many films have been made here because this is a very magical feeling place. Plant life here is so amazing. There are logs and trees covered in moss and like clovers and snowdrops and all of these ferns everywhere like this one really remind me of being like in a rainforest or something. Like I imagine in a video this could look like a really humid like tropical uh, rainforest. But it's got actually, Jurassic Park vibes. Yeah, like Jurassic Park, exactly. And the way that you have all the wood and the rocks covered in moss and kind of completely untouched because we have the walkways, it keeps it all protected. There is a particular scene from Star Wars The Force Awakened that was filmed here and we're actually trying to find the spot. I'm not sure if we're going to find it because it all looks pretty much identical to the movie, so these kind of rocks and things beside me. Now for those of you that haven't seen this Star Wars movie, we have taken the liberty to provide you with a very accurate representation of the movie. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Emma. I am your brother. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> Today's video was brought to you by our patrons. Thank you, patrons. You're our only hope. <laughs> oh no, my hair's falling out. I do oh no. Hold on. One warning when coming to Puzzlewood, it is very, very likely that an Ewok will come out and attack you at any moment, so all precautions must be taken in advance. I actually recommend if you can get some like bear spray or something like that, and yes. then Americans just bring a gun, that's even better. <laughs> <laughs> or a lightsaber. For those of you who love the look of this place, we have a treat in store for you in the next video because we are stopping here en route to our final destination, which is actually a castle that we will be staying in tonight. We are so excited about this. I think this has to be such a fantastic destination to come for a weekend or a few days because not only do you have the woods nearby, but you can stay in a bloody castle. Not only is it a castle, it's a YHA. So it's reasonably priced! <laughs> there is nothing quite like walking through a magical enchanted forest and then having the illusion destroyed when I spot my eyes on a fucking nappy! <laughs> you piece of shit! I mean, literally, <laughs> but the person that has taken their baby's nappy and thrown it into this magical, wonderful place and ruined my day. I'm furious. <laughs> furious! If that's any of you guys at home, unsubscribe or I'm banning you if there was a way of finding out. <laughs> Just before we make our way to the castle and end this video, we have some news for you. I bet the first thought is like, they're pregnant. Or they're getting married. Sorry Neither. guys, <laughs> neither of those things are happening just yet. But it's much better than that. <laughs> much, much better. For those that are new to the channel, last year we began our search for happiness. And one of the main goals we had for the year was for me to come off antidepressants. And I'm so happy to say that I have successfully ticked that goal off of the list. It has been one month since I've taken antidepressants and I am feeling fucking fantastic, <laughs> you guys. And actually, I think being home in nature, exploring our own country has played a huge, huge role in that. Alongside the digital nomad lifestyle, working online, creating our days and our weeks and months, however we want to, has played a huge, huge role in that. So if that isn't a reason to give this a big <laughs> thumbs up, please do that. <laughs> And leave us a comment, where is the most magical forest you've ever been? And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, I find your lack of faith very disturbing! <laughs> so do it now! And without further ado, it's the thing I always do, especially you newbies, you're going to be very surprised right now, <laughs> because I'm going to scream right directly into your ears. Be Beads out! <laughs> <laughs>